Aloha, everybody. Uh, Craig Chi, myself, and Lena Girl are on Maui. Again, we are so excited. We get to present the first of two checks that we are going to be giving to Maui Food Bank. And we wanted to make sure to get it to them as soon as possible so they could continue doing the great work that they've been doing. And we want to say a very big mahalo to everyone that enjoyed the live stream, that jumped on and, and got their auction items from the Upulele site. It was fantastic and super awesome. And we're here to represent you. Uh, but at the same time, we still want to be able to help the island of Maui. So we're going to pick up a big giant check and we are supporting our local businesses. Okay, um, at the next light, I need to turn right. Yeah, but <laughs> we're, we are um, gonna be supporting Maui Printing Company. We're gonna go pick up a big check and deliver it to our friends at the Maui Food Bank. Here at Maui Food Bank with our executive director, Rich Eust, and it's been an incredible ride with music and meals for Maui, having our entire ukulele community. And when I say entire, I mean worldwide. Ukulele community come together for our families of Lahaina and you know, indirectly also for our families all of Maui. Mm -hmm. Rich, thank you so much for spending some time with me mm -hmm. and, and having us just talk story a little bit about um, how Maui Food Bank is helping specifically after the fires, but also for families that are, are on Maui needing help. Yeah, it's been an amazing, amazing journey. It's been extremely busy, as you might expect. Yeah, we mobilized instantly after the, after the disaster. Uh, our trucks were ready to roll, instantly trying to provide food to the shelters, people that had been displaced, uh, people who had moved in with other people, uh, and all of a sudden they had a lot more mouths to feed, so right. we were providing food to those families and still are. So typically we distribute maybe 250,000 pounds of food a month. We've already, since the fires, which is only going on two months now, is 1.6 million pounds of food. Oh my goodness, yeah. you hit them. And, and, and the thing is that, as, as, and that's amazing. I don't ever want to take away from that. But I believe the, the need is still there. The need yeah. is still there. We're bringing in food. We're buying from local farmers to meet the need. We're trying to support local farmers who have been so impacted by this disaster. I mean, so many restaurants. And now with tourism declining, these, the farmers are really suffering. So we're doing our best to purchase as much local produce as we can and make sure that gets into the mouths of the folks who have been affected. So helping out the local farmers, helping out other local businesses, and at the same time trying to feed our families here on Maui, that's mm -hmm. a lot on your plate. <laughs> it's a lot. So I've got a friend who is here um, to present you with a gift. Um, again, this is on behalf of our ukulele community. Uh, and and we, we know this is probably just a small dent, but we hope it's a big oh, enough it's... dent that it's gonna matter. Hey, Sarah, bring that in. <laughs> there we go. Fantastic. Yes. Yes. On behalf of um, Craig and Sarah and our, our ukulele community, Rich, we'd like to present you with this first of two checks. This first check of $110,000 to help, you know, do a little something for our Maui family. Is this something that you can use? We are so grateful. This will go a long way. And this will go a long way also to support our local economy. So go a long way to feed the hungry and feed those people who have been displaced or impacted by this disaster. Now, Thank I you. do have one final question for you. A lot of our ukulele family, they want to know how else can they, they help? I mean, is is this it? Or, you know, is, is there anything more Oh my we gosh, do? we're going to need ongoing support. You know, we know that this is going to be a long road to recovery. Certainly it's not over by any stretch of the imagination. We've got many families families that are still needing our support. Uh, we're still providing mass quantities of food throughout the community because now with the lack of tourism on, on Maui, it's, it's affecting multiple uh, parts of the island. Yeah. And so we're so grateful for this. And people can just donate online at our MauiFoodBank.org uh, website. Perfect. But for now, let's go ahead and celebrate just this sweet success. We thank you so much for all that you've done and all that you've donated for this cause. Maui Food Bank, oh, Maui no ka oi. Mahalo. We just came back from our Maui trip and I mean, there are this whole community, all of us coming together, thank you all so, so much for your time, your talents, your treasures to allow us to be able to uh, give so much to those on Maui, to Maui Food Bank.
And we are so grateful to be a part of this community, I think, um, in regards to, I, it's amazing to me, and I'm still shocked by it, um, at what our ukulele community did for this one moment, this one six hour event, um, and of course, all the wonderful ukuleles that were donated and then sold out on the ukulele sites auction. I just, I, I am always gonna be amazed at what our ukulele community can do. You folks proved it that that little four string instrument yeah. can do so much. Yes, so thank you all so, so much. And thank you for coming on this journey with us too. There's gonna be more happening. So oh, yeah. make sure you, you stay tuned, Craig and Sarah, as well as four strings at a time.